502 Insights, where we talk about a little bit of everything. For our first trash formation musical instrument, we're going to make a harp. I had a long rectangular box that was holding a roll of paper and a tube from wrapping paper. I cut this box in half and put holes on each side to hold on to the wrapping paper roll. So the end of the wrapping paper tube will go into the holes that we put into the box and then the bottom will have to be secured with hot glue. So here's the harp base all glued together. Now we just need to let the kids decorate it and then we'll add the strings. For our next instrument, we're gonna use an O2 liter bottle, a ramen noodle bow, and an old horn we had laying around from a birthday party and make a trumpet. So I cut the two liter bottle right on the line at the end and cut that end all the way off. Then I'm gonna take my old birthday horn and stick that through this way. And I'm gonna take my ramen noodle container and put it through this way. And then I need to secure all of that with hot glue. So here's our instrument all glued together. It is similar to a trumpet and it actually plays music. Now we just need to let the kids decorate it. For our next instrument, we're gonna make a guitar from an old gallon water bottle and a paint stick. Okay, so I've cut a hole out, a round hole in the middle of the water bottle, and then I stuck the paint stick inside the spout at the top, and I hot glued that in to secure it. Now I'm gonna let the kids decorate it, and then we'll add strings so it will play music. Okay, so for this musical instrument, we're going to make a trumpet out of garbage. So I took the old wrapping paper tube that wasn't hard, it was very soft. I glued the ends together so it stayed together because it unrolled. And then I put it into the shape of a trumpet. I took the old birthday hat, cut the end off, stuck that in, and glued that down to create the two part at the end. And then on this side, I'm going to take another old birthday horn, stick that in, secure it so you could blow it. Now this one took a lot of manipulation to get it together, so I'm also gonna add some duct tape to hold it together. Okay, here's my trumpet, all hot glued and taped together, and I did add the end of the birthday hat over the old birthday horn so that it matched the top. For my last trash musical instrument, we're going to make a wearable drum. I have an old drawstring backpack that we got free from something we attended, an old butter container, an old plastic dish that we had from Christmas, and then an old plastic vase. So what I'm gonna do is stack these three things together like this, secure them, and then place them inside the backpack. Okay, as you can see, I secure this pretty well. I put a lot of hot glue, and then I put masking tape around it. So I don't want this to just fall apart in the drawstring backpack when the kids actually go to beat on it to play music. Okay, so I placed my stack of plastic containers into the bag, I cinched it tight around the instruments, and then I tied these little ribbons on just to keep the drawstring in place. Then we're gonna use some old rolls from some vinyl I had for a different color. We use that as our drumsticks. Hello, here is our finished harp, all decorated by a seven-year-old. And I've added rubber bands going from the top with the push pin to the bottom, and then rubber bands that have went around and across each push pin, going each way to secure them. 
and I've also added hot glue on each one. So you can play music on it and the push pins stay securely in place. You could also buy very large rubber bands and wrap them all the way around and then secure them with tape. And here is our finished guitar. It's been decorated by a six-year-old. And we have added strings made out of rubber bands. You can play music with them. They've been added with push pins on each end and then secured with more rubber bands going around the guitar to hold them in place. And hot glue was also added. That way when you play it, nothing comes loose to injure your child. Here, here's the finished horn, decorated by a three-year-old. It has the birthday horn at the end, so when you blow in it, it does play music. And here is our finished drum that is wearable with our drumsticks. The child can Put the straps on here and wear this in the front and carry it around to play the drums. This was decorated by our five-year-old. Okay, here's all of our completed instruments that we've made out of trash. They all play music, but if you decide to make these at home, please make sure you supervise the kids while you use them because they do have small parts. And they do have some parts that can be sharp if they come loose. So, you know, use those accordingly. Make it age appropriate for your child. I hope you like this video. If you do, please subscribe, like, and share. Thank you.